Hi there, Virgo. Thank you so much for tuning in. Love and light to you all here. We're here with your very personal full moon in Virgo reading. So very exciting. Oh my goodness, it's your full moon. So the full moon, right, in general, being a point of the highest peak of energy flow. I'm hearing Capricorn here strongly. I'm hearing cast iron <laughs> right, right out of the, right out of the bat, right out of the bat. Okay. Um, <laughs> let's, let's open the bat up and see what's I'm hearing really, uh, powering it up here. The eight of cups, the eight of pentacles in reverse. I said cups, take it as you will. The judgment card in reverse, dear Virgo. Uh, before we get into it though, uh, literally into it, into, into, I'm hearing into the, uh, into this discussion space as well here. Perhaps again, if you're dealing with a Capricorn or matters related to Capricorn, we got it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> In your very personal chart, your Capricorn. <laughs> Mother of Pentacles coming through. I'm hearing it's a, it's a matter of honesty. Um, okay, and we're going to be getting into this discussion here. I'm seeing that there is a very prominent prominent point I'm hearing of... Uh, of, uh, of uh, I'm hearing um, connection, communication that... I'm hearing it has to do with partnerships for a number of you that it comes through. Now, uh, dear Virgo, again, this is your full moon of Virgo reading. Of course, energy is fluid. It may resonate a few days before the exact point with the full moon peaks, if you may, a few days after. Um, so take it as you will, right? You may start feeling these energies a few weeks prior, even you may have started to feel these energies building, right? And uh, even a few weeks after. So take it as you will, however you feel guided to watch as well. Whatever you feel speaks to you, specifically in whatever area of life that you feel speaks to you in. Always use your personal intuition, Virgo. And thank you all so much before again for connecting and tuning into you thank you so much Virgo for your dear support as well energetically above and beyond all and let's get started here for you now Virgo Virgo I'm getting for you that I'm hearing there's the feeling and the sensation that I'm hearing enough grapes have grown on the vine already to know that we want, I'm hearing, to make grape juice. <laughs> okay, let's put it in that way. The two of cups is in reverse and the ten of swords is upright. I'm hearing, this is a space that you've been really, I'm hearing, thinking about. I'm hearing honestly, honesty here with the father of swords. I'm seeing that it's a major theme here around this time. What is it that we really desire? I'm hearing that we also desire to bring into manifestation fruition. And be it the honesty of your vision as well, the clarity I'm hearing of what you want to, uh, I'm hearing, uh, I'm hearing, uh, click. I'm hearing clear the air with as well. I'm hearing specifically this might be related to a certain person that you want to kind of communicate with and uh, uh, could be related to matters of a certain, I'm hearing home life dynamic. I'm hearing symphony here, orchestra as well with the higher fund reverse. It could be a certain position. I'm hearing job title as well. Now, depends on what, right, where Virgo sits in your very personal chart. If Virgo is sitting, let's say, on your midhaven angle sign, the highest point in your birth chart, then uh, there could be a focus. And this would most likely mean, let's say your son is in Virgo. Uh, this would, and let's say they're Midhaven as well as in Virgo, this would most likely mean that your son is um, closely situated to your Midhaven angle. So, um, all right. Now, to say that uh, Virgo, e again, I'm seeing, for example, let's say that, where I was going to say, let's say that you've got your son in Virgo, okay? Or your Midhaven in Virgo. Um, there could be a focus on what you would like to have i'm hearing a very clear sense of uh i'm hearing direction with at this point here it comes the ace of swords dear virgo um i'm hearing play playing with our swords here the ace of swords and the star i'm hearing but making sure that the chalice is uh i'm hearing uh is is ready to be struck i'm hearing very interesting with our words who virgo the ace of cups and the emperor now um before we get into it i'm getting again for you this is something that you've been really, I'm hearing, working on. The Sun of Cups I'm hearing, coming out with. And it has to do with what you are feeling so deeply compelled to communicate about. Again, be it in a certain way to even your audience, right? Let's say that you have a certain, I'm hearing, very large also social circle, network, group of people who I'm hearing you even hang around with. It's like guys, I'm hearing girls, gather around. I, I'm hearing, I am here uh, to, uh, I'm hearing, uh, I'm hearing, I'm uh, hearing, throw i'm hearing i'm hearing throw here the chariot and the five of cups um the ace of wands and the daughter of cups and the two of wands at the base of the daughter of cups two 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 i'm hearing 
to move forward. I'm hearing in a completely new direction and I'm hearing honey that changes a lot of things here. I'm hearing it specifically in that way in whatever way that might be meant for you. And I'm seeing you like being very adamant and very direct with what your decision is. I'm hearing again, what is your decision Virgo? Regardless of what you feel moves through, I'm hearing the vortex with you. When you decide on what it is that you do to be your ultimate, I'm hearing identity of purpose. Ooh. And there is a focus on the community space. Yes, I'm hearing that specifically for a number of you. What you feel uh, has in a certain way counted down the days with you, uh, but not necessarily. I'm hearing counted the clock. Uh, I'm hearing... Um, I'm hearing backward in time at the same pace in whatever way that might be meant for a number of you. I'm not quite sure what that might mean. It could be related here specifically to timelines. And I'm seeing that someone might have a really kind of like different, I'm hearing, or, or I'm hearing different conception of uh, even the concept here of uh, children. I'm hearing family life. Uh, okay. But Virgo, let's, let's, uh, let's, let's move into it. I'm seeing you again. And I was, when I was meditating on your virtual camera, oh my goodness. The energy was so powerful. I was seeing like a like a child. I was I was actually seeing like a child, like a, like an infant, who for the very first time comes into touch with. Um, I'm hearing a fruit that holds color. Wow, and I'm seeing it as related to the star. I'm seeing like a big red apple, and I'm seeing this child like almost like like a like, it's almost like a blow up doll. It's like very interesting, <laughs> like kind of like uh, I'm hearing caught. I'm hearing by uh, I'm hearing by the glaze of. I'm hearing the donut. Uh, I'm hearing hole here with a star and I'm seeing that this is almost like happening in space Like I'm seeing this happening like in the universe Virgo <laughs> Like something something happening. I'm hearing perhaps on an energetic spiritual level. I'm hearing it has to do with what perhaps you have been um getting a lot of uh i'm hearing rain checks here in order for related to the chariot of the five of cups i'm seeing that it has to do with a certain role that you see yourself i'm hearing not only playing out but also uh i'm hearing presenting and it's like what does it mean to present something and what does it mean to carry something out and to i'm hearing also compromise it in a certain way very interesting to enable and to ensure that the space that it holds rings true i'm hearing for the bell that is struck again i'm seeing like i'm seeing bells and chimes that are struck i'm hearing by wind as well and but specifically by words virgo i'm seeing that your words around this time you feel are i'm hearing they hold uh i'm hearing they they hold uh they hold uh um i'm hearing um movement i'm hearing also magic and for number two i'm seeing specifically that you you might be carrying out a certain type of um I'm hearing claws here related to the Ace of Swords and the Father of Swords. You may be writing up a contract and it's something that perhaps you feel. I'm hearing he heavy speaking. I'm hearing a lot of speaking, a lot of, there's been a lot of, uh, I'm hearing holding as well. I'm hearing the, the palette. I'm hearing the paint and the brush uh, in hand to, uh, to, to, to test. I'm hearing our theory out here at the right time. When we feel that we, I'm hearing, have the words to work with it. I'm hearing the dance of the dream now the daughter wants coming through virgo i'm hearing it's a matter of speaking again i'm hearing specifically i'm seeing it's like what good is the actor when they've got no lines i'm hearing specifically what, what, what good is uh i'm hearing the memory if it doesn't uh i'm hearing memorize i'm hearing the words very interesting I'm seeing, and whatever that i meant for an overview always take it as you will but there's a focus on uh not necessarily on any particular way virgo right but i'm seeing that there's a focus on what you feel i'm hearing so 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 connected to because i'm hearing specifically because it hurts when you don't i'm hearing hold it i'm hearing in the space that you call home and what does that mean, Virgo? I'm seeing that let's let's say it in this way, in a simple way, that there is a there is a there is a dream here. There's a very clear also space that perhaps you see yourself in, where you're like, I know, I'm hearing I was made, I'm hearing I'm hearing with these feathers on my wings for a reason. I'm not here to just, I'm hearing drown. I'm here to fly. I'm hearing it specifically here related to the father of uh, cups in the chair. And I'm hearing for a number of you that this has been a long cycle emotionally as well that you've been moving through. And be it related to family, be it related to the concept of even birth. I'm hearing cycles, children, what we feel we are moving through. And I'm hearing inner child as well. 
dear Virgo, I'm seeing that again. I, I was as I was mentioning your introvert turn the camera. There, there, there was this vision of like a child, an infant. They're like I'm hearing they're glowing. Like I'm seeing literally, like they have their their cheeks are are um, like I'm hearing packed i'm hearing packed with with uh with uh um with joy i'm hearing joy um and uh as well uh i'm hearing joy de vivre is that that i think that means in french seize the day right? the, the joy to live Okay, like the the happiness of the moment. I'm hearing baby, baby birth. I'm hearing coming with the mother of wands in reverse. Two of wands of right, the daughter of wands of four of cups. Now, um, Virgo, <laughs> I'm hearing, do we marry them? I'm hearing first, or do we message them? <laughs> I'm hearing after, very interesting. And whatever that might be meant for number one, I'm missing for number you could be, and if you've got a lot of Virgo on your chart, you've got a lot of Earth in your chart, there could absolutely be this propensity of like, well, yeah, okay, is it, do I, I'm hearing, do, do, do I, do I commit? I'm hearing before I communicate, I'm, I'm hearing it specifically. Do I, do I, do, I'm hearing spread the news before I have, uh, I'm hearing done the dance routine a few times here, out the hermit in reverse. I'm seeing there's a question of how you feel that you personify a certain space. How it is it emotionally, I'm hearing specifically, you feel connected to what it is that you communicate and carry out as a long distance run here. And I'm hearing climb specifically with the Daughter of Cups here in reverse. Now there could be a certain space uh, that you feel um, I'm hearing you want to uh, you want to you want to uh, circle back to. I'm hearing the storm. It could be related to a water sign. So it's got a lot of water. I'm hearing a lot of Earth as well. Could be Taurus, Virgo. I'm hearing Aries strongly that they could have a lot of Aries in their chart. First house energy strongly placed Mars. Mars in a fire sign specifically. I'm hearing at like 20 degrees. I'm hearing ah oh, shucks. I'm hearing specifically. I'm hearing Mary specifically. Whatever that may mean in particular for a number of you. Okay. Um, however, again Virgo. I'm seeing again this this baby with like full cheeks, full cheeks, and. Uh, I'm seeing them drawing closer like I'm hearing it's the very first time I'm hearing that they that they I'm hearing touch the womb oh Virgo it's so powerful I'm seeing colors I'm seeing uh, turquoise I'm seeing purple I'm see I'm hearing brown as well I'm seeing uh, I'm hearing spaces shapes colors I'm hearing figures that uh, I'm hearing don't uh, I'm hearing transcend the. Uh, I'm hearing. I'm hearing the the future. I'm hearing, but live within the limits of how they. I'm hearing learn our name first. Very interesting, uh, Virgo. I'm seeing that there is a certain focus on the. Uh, I'm hearing the. The, I'm hearing cast iron again. And if you think about cast iron, that's like a really heavy duty piece of uh, cooking uh, <laughs> machinery, you can call it. Nine of a cups in reverse and the mother wants in reverse. Okay, Virgo. Now I'm seeing, I'm hearing, there's a lot of heat. There's a lot of heat. There's a lot, I'm you. I'm hearing you are you are in a survey burning alive with the message that you want to deliver. And I'm seeing it has to do perhaps for a number of you. Um, with I'm hearing Cali. I'm seeing C C C A L L I E. I'm hearing I'm hearing uh, I'm hearing also California strongly, but um, I'm seeing um, I'm hearing ooh I'm hearing camphor C A M P H O R. Is that an herb? <laughs> okay, let's uh, pull a few more cards, dear Virgo, and I want to close this. Let's get that out of the way. Okay, I'm hearing ooh talking about it. I'm hearing specifically. I'm hearing uh, the testing here, the test here with the magician and the seven of pentacles. All right, now let's uh, pull a few cards and see what comes through with Virgo. I'm hearing again, do we call them? I'm hearing, do we call them? Do we message them or do we marry them first? Again, I'm hearing that specifically Virgo. It's so interesting. I'm seeing, and if you think about right, marriage, what is the concept of marriage? I'm hearing commitment, but what exactly is that? Is it right considered as a space that we hold? I'm hearing in terms of what we, I'm hearing commit to it. I'm hearing within it. Very interesting. It's like, if I am going to tell someone that I am committed to them um, and be it a decision that you're carrying out even on a professional level, if I'm accepting, I'm hearing this uh, position, I'm hearing this 
title on this project as well. Um, before it is that I that I that I commit to the project, what is it that I am here commit to in the space that I am hearing observe my role in the project? Very interesting, and I'm seeing that being the question of you know is is that something that I'm hearing I, I want? Is that something that I feel uh, I'm hearing also that I'm wanted for to play the role out as? And see if for number this might have to do specifically with with the position with the job title, and it's like okay, they're hiring me for I'm hearing holding a candle in my hand. I'm hearing, but am, am I? I'm hearing the one who's actually burning the wax, and I'm hearing if if that is so, is is it a matter of uh, I'm hearing being really honest about that? Like I'm hearing I'm not here to count. I'm hearing acorns here, the three of uh, cups, the two of uh, cups, and the nine of pentacles in your I'm not sure what that might mean, but I'm seeing someone like kind of being like, uh, I'm hearing I'm getting hired for some kind of uh, hand holding job, and I'm hearing I really want to work with like. I'm hearing, uh, I'm hearing, uh, uh, tra transforming. I'm hearing the feet here with the fool and the ace of wands. Very interesting. The ten of, uh, ten of pentacles. Um, okay, and the wheel of fortune right over this ten of pentacles in reverse. Judgment upright. I'm hearing we are just. Uh, I'm hearing. Uh, um, I'm hearing. I'm hearing joyous here. I'm hearing glad. I'm hearing glad. We are, I'm hearing, m motivated. So I'm hearing deeply feeling perhaps motivated. I'm hearing sensation. I'm seeing like very, I'm hearing like palpable feelings of, uh, I'm hearing even readiness to present um, in a certain way. A question of potential. Yes, a question. And I'm seeing you kind of being like, well, I gotta hold that question on myself first. I gotta make it I'm hearing really clear to myself first what it is that I uh, I'm hearing really want in this space that I, I'm hearing commit myself to. Very interesting. And it's like yet again, it's like if, if I get accepted for a job title, I'm seeing you getting really clear on this Virgo. Like if I if I accept again this one proposal, this one this one I'm hearing presentation as well, when I am let's say having it, holding it, standing on that stage, what is it exactly? What is it? exactly that i am uh, i'm hearing uh, working on in that very moment and does it work for me and what works for me do i feel that it works i'm hearing for others in that space not in terms of does it work for them because it works for me or does it work for me because it works for them but in the space of do i feel that i'm hearing it's ready very interesting i'm hearing to welcome the space that I want to hold it as. Very interesting. Now, seeing you kind of being, uh, seeing, seeing, seeing your future as like a start to finish timeline, Virgo. Like, I'm hearing this is where it starts and this is where it ends and this is where we walk in through the front door and this is how it kind of leads out. I'm seeing you have a very clear idea of, let's say, the scaffolding, the structures, and uh, also I'm hearing the. Uh, the stationary with the lovers and the wheel of fortune i'm seeing that you have a very clear objective sort of um view of what it is that you carry now again i was going to say if you've got a lot of earth in your chart virgo taurus a capricorn there is the feeling of uh again like before i am hearing commit to something or before i let's say even tell myself that i want to play that character um i'm hearing i gotta make sure that i i'm hearing ask my question i'm hearing to myself first very and it's like how is it that what it is that i feel i also may want to propose um or let's say accept as a as a i'm hearing as a vision i'm hearing as a visit as well um and as a value i'm hearing strongly is a question that i first i'm hearing pop to myself and then i feel i'm hearing proud proud to uh i'm hearing to uh to uh to uh, align with here in a public way interesting and i'm seeing it as related to how you present something virgo i'm hearing scorpio strong and capricorn strongly and how does it you feel that there's a certain space that that i'm hearing form presentation holds the attention of now there is a very public space that you might be stepping into real soon here i'm hearing down the line i'm hearing in two months i'm hearing two two times i'm hearing two weeks i'm hearing it as like two sessions as well i'm seeing you like visiting perhaps even a certain space uh, like one time and then you visit again like another time i'm hearing and i'm seeing the the number t the number t what is the number t in the alphabet if anybody knows please comment here okay i'm hearing 14 i'm hearing 24 and 26 as well in whatever way that might be meant for a number of you there is a uh, focus on I'm hearing a, uh, uh, a, a, uh, I'm hearing a, a person here in mind that you may have in it. There is the focus here specifically on the archetype of Scorpio, perhaps in some kind of way. I'm seeing that I'm hearing, you realize I'm hearing, I can't be shy. And I'm seeing, the, I'm seeing the color green, like, like, uh, 
so interesting. <laughs> I'm seeing like these underwater creatures, like almost like fish that are almost just purely vertebrae that are like that found deep, 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 deep beneath the sea, the very base of the ocean, uh, the very bottom of the bottom of the ocean. And uh, the, I, I remember watching some documentaries on um, these these creatures and they kind of like they almost look like they're just electric like you just you you see their impulses kind of uh, shoot shooting off like through their limbs so to speak there where where the, where their I'm hearing wings would be very interesting I'm hearing spark okay but um specifically uh where where their I'm hearing their their channels are very interesting I'm hearing where they're channeling from as well um but uh, specifically their <laughs> their um fins okay and i'm i'm um, getting here it's interesting because again if you if you watch right those creatures under the water and it's pitch black right and um they just all of a sudden they just they kind of they light up and it's this uh i'm hearing uh this uh, multi multi-dimensional effect here i'm not sure what that might mean but i'm seeing it specifically as related to the death card now and I'm, it's interesting because i'm almost seeing this uh I'm hearing this pulsation of green light here with the death card right here around the chest area, and that is where the heart chakra sits. And I'm hearing throat chakra uh, as well here with the six of wands, caught sight of the butterfly, which is a beautiful turquoise, deep turquoise color. Okay, um, that speaks to throat chakra specifically. Now there is a focus on, in a very clear, clear, clear vision, Virgo. I'm hearing. Uh, Aquarius. I'm hearing Aries strongly as well of what it is that you see yourself carrying out and what it is that you see I'm hearing co really coloring in and again there's this focus on color for you Virgo when I was meditating energy was so again palpable I'm hearing how you um, feel that also what you present and how you present it holds a certain effect I'm hearing vibrationally upon the spaces that you I'm hearing carry it out within now remember this could be a form of uh, I'm hearing uh, healing here, though. Also, um, I'm hearing uh, I'm hearing characterization again. I'm hearing characterization of a certain project. I'm hearing act the way in which you see uh, yourself carrying out a certain type of experience. Now, um, Virgo, I'm hearing it's long distance here between the Strength card and the Empress, the Sun as well. There's a focus, perhaps, for a number of you on what you feel. I'm hearing it's not just time that tells me when uh, it's my turn. I'm hearing to speak out. There's a focus on what the uh, I'm hearing the temperature feels like in that room, and that is uh, not a space that I necessarily. Uh, I'm hearing. Uh, I'm hearing look at. I'm hearing face to face and decide. I'm hearing the numerical value of here related to Three of Cups. Very interesting. Now, for a number, you could be working with matters that are um, related to contracts, okay, and negotiation for a number of you, but uh, as well here, Virgo, I'm seeing that you're gauging something, okay? I'm seeing that you are wanting to feel that the decisions that you make are absolutes, where it's like, okay, let's say that I'm thinking of partnering up with someone. Let's say that we're writing out a contract. Let's say we're starting up a certain business. I'm hearing frontline, I'm hearing specifically. For number this could be related to animals, pets. I'm hearing veterinarian. I'm seeing also, um, I'm hearing P. I'm seeing the letter P. Uh, I'm hearing pediatrics. Okay, nonetheless, uh, it's like, okay, if I'm thinking of, let's say, partnering up with these three individuals, these two individuals, um, I'm hearing Tim, Tim. I'm hearing Timothy and Tommy. Um, okay, nonetheless, and I'm hearing Tin, T-I-N. I'm hearing Felicia. I'm seeing the letter F as well. Okay. Nonetheless, um, <laughs> the three of uh, the three of uh, the three of cups. I'm seeing it. It's like yet again. It's like if I'm going to be. It's like this sort of feeling. Like if I'm going to be, let's say, opening up also a certain business. I'm hearing a shop with these keepers. <laughs> um, I want to really, I'm hearing, ensure that we all know how to dance together and not just as, let's say, a line that we all learned to sing in unison, but where we feel like our hands, I'm hearing, just magnetically connect to one another and we stand there, I'm hearing, in awe of our own experience, I'm hearing, of sharing the moment, I'm hearing, together, and I'm seeing you kind of feeling like I wanted to just magnetically kind of come together. I just want to feel that what it is that I make, I'm hearing, I'm hearing also money from, doesn't feel like it's just, I'm hearing a fabrication of my uh, my fractions and my decimal points here. I'm hearing in a physical way, where it's like, hi, I'm hearing, I punched the numbers, I'm hearing, I did the accounting, and I'm done for the day, bye! It's like, <laughs> no, I'm hearing, I want to feel and I want to know that what it is that I'm even learning, let's say, in the space of even academics, is something that I am hearing can also, I'm hearing, love. 
to do. And the question space of what evolves for you, Virgo, in terms of what you see yourself carrying out in a physical way, in a public way, in a performative way, is so very relevant around this time. The feeling and the desire to connect with, again, our decisions. Where it's like, I'm hearing, I'm hearing, uh, do I, I'm hearing, do I propose this? I'm hearing this manual, I'm hearing as well. Do I message them? I'm hearing again for a number of you. Do I make money from this? I'm hearing as well for a number of you. And I'm seeing kind of like standing on the, on the very, I'm hearing edge of your own, uh, I'm hearing storyline to ask yourself this question. Is it mine? I'm hearing, does my mission bleed through? the pages i'm hearing that i make money with i'm hearing that for a number of you but as well that i i'm hearing manifest this potential as i'm hearing do i see myself in it and I'm seeing someone, it's so interesting, I'm seeing someone who like wrote a script. And they were like, okay, I'm hearing, this could make a ton of money. I'm hearing, there's no question, there's no doubt that this could be the, the, not the next big hit, but the first, uh, I'm hearing, I'm hearing hit that hits home here with the strength part of the tempest around, whatever way that might be. For number you, the strength, sun and the empress of right. Um, I'm hearing you're very sure of something. I'm hearing you've put a lot of time and energy into it, a whole lot of work. Oh my goodness. And you've got a lot of, I'm hearing, backing funding financially for a number of you. I'm hearing strongly. You may have actually investors here that are, uh, uh, I'm hearing, uh, visualizing your product already. Okay. Let's say it like that. But I'm hearing at the end of the day, I'm seeing you standing at the door and I'm hearing feeling, I'm hearing the, uh, the question I'm hearing in your hand as you hold your hand on, I'm hearing the door of the knob. Very interesting. <laughs> okay. And um, in a certain way, Virgo, I'm hearing transcending the illusion of what I'm hearing looks at you face to face as you lock eyes with this future. What is it all for? I'm hearing the analysis, the friction. Sorry about the Virgo, the phone cut there. Okay, and we're saying, um, I'm hearing the friction again, and I'm hearing it almost as like a form of pressure. And I was just hearing for you as the phone cut off there. I was hearing that song by Sia. Cause I'm alive. I'm alive. I'm hearing that there is a focus, Virgo, on the awakening. Four wands upright. Now, you see things that startle you, I'm hearing specifically. I'm hearing third eye awareness here. You know that I'm hearing what is kind of, I'm hearing dwindling as well, what isn't really, I'm hearing fully working out. I'm hearing is not a matter of a solution. It's not a matter of, I'm hearing finding the, the uh, I'm hearing the, the, the point of, uh, of uh, fantasy, I'm hearing and undoing it and, and uh, I'm hearing relabeling it. It's like, it's not a matter of, I'm hearing also understanding where the friction lies in a certain uh, ma matter, I'm hearing specifically, and, uh, and um, undoing it. It's not a matter of the, I'm hearing the discussion itself. We can talk, I'm hearing, years on end about how a certain project can work out in a certain way, how a certain partnership makes absolute complete sense, how a certain person, I'm hearing, is made for us and we're made for them. What is it that, I'm hearing, you know without a doubt, Virgo, that is not a matter of doing Right, Son of Pentacles at the base of the Four Wands. What is not a matter of
dismantling and dismantling and mantling again and dismantling and mantling and dismantling <laughs> like getting the frame perfectly on the wall it's like i'm hearing yeah i'm hearing yes i'm a virgo <laughs> excuse me everyone hello i i can make sure that that painting is perfectly situated um with a prognosis intact <laughs> okay it's like Yes, I'm hearing there is there is the ability, let's say, to I'm hearing race to that kind of finish line. But what is it that I'm hearing really we want to orient? Really that we see, I'm hearing the many details that we have, I'm hearing a certain level of, uh, I'm hearing awareness of, I'm hearing guidance towards as well, the, the interpretation of. I'm hearing wanting to work on. And I'm seeing this as like Virgo, like you're like, I don't, I'm here specifically. I don't want to feel like I'm marketing marbles. I mean, if I don't believe I'm hearing in where they roll. Two, I'm hearing when we, when we, when we, when we play with them, when, when we hold them in our hand and we, we sing, I'm hearing jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle all the way. I'm not sure what that might mean, <laughs> forgot. But I'm saying specifically that I'm hearing there's a certain space of uh, stamina that you're like, again, I'm hearing we can technically, we can technically, it's not a question of technicality, we can technically, I'm hearing, make this work. We can technically, uh, I'm hearing, do, do the, uh, do the, uh, the distance, I'm hearing, because I can go the distance. And I'm seeing from number of you, like you've got a lot of Capricorn in your chart, you've got a lot of Virgo in your chart, or you've got a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of Taurus in your chart, um, Earth energy in general, especially with your Mars, I'm hearing specifically. Uh, I'm seeing the number three specifically here in some kind of way. Uh, I'm hearing you, you are, uh, I'm hearing you're, you're like a Tonka truck. I'm not sure what that might mean again, Virgo, but I'm seeing specifically like you, you, you see your own potential i'm hearing in, in certain ways in terms of uh what you can let's say carry out practically and you may have a real i mean a lot of stamina in terms of how you i'm hearing physically also uh uh i'm hearing uh um i'm hearing uh border i'm hearing cage like almost can can, can let's say carry a certain space out now <laughs> virgo i'm seeing you again though being very clear on this concept that what is i'm hearing a possibility is not necessarily love i'm hearing that looks at us the way that we look at it what does that mean what is love not to say in any particular way virgo i'm hearing scorpio strongly take it as you will i'm hearing sagittarius as well to say it in this way if we see possibility in a certain space i'm hearing playing pretend in whatever way that might be meant for you related here to the mother of wands and the hanged man if we see potential in a certain space, if we know something can, I'm hearing, uh, I'm hearing pop, I'm hearing balloon party. I'm not sure what that might mean. It, like we can get a lot of followers for this. If we do, if we do the X, Y, Z, if we, I'm hearing hold this certain, I'm hearing also, I'm hearing guest list. I'm hearing host event, whatever it may be a channel. I'm hearing as well. Yes, we could technically, uh, have a lot of hands to hold at the end of the night. I'm hearing, but what is it? What, is, what I'm hearing, what is it really? I'm hearing that the refreshments in that room, uh, I'm hearing reserve the space for, if I feel that my role in it is not, I'm hearing walked through here with the Eight of Pentacles and the Ten of Swords, the Six of Wands. And I'm seeing kind of like shying away from, let's say, a certain, I'm hearing place that you called home. I'm hearing shelter here with the Hanged Man and the Mother of Wands. A certain space of, uh, I'm hearing hanging on. I'm hearing again, because I'm alive. I'm alive. Like, it's like at the end of the day, I'm hearing if we were cast in that role, I'm hearing as Esmeralda, I'm not sure <laughs> what that might mean. I'm doing an overview. Um, 
I'm hearing also uh, Zenith. I'm hearing the Zenith here with the chariot, the Sun of Wands, and the Full Moon is like a space in which you were like hyper glorified. Like, Virgo, Virgo, I'm hearing, tell us uh, what the next version is. I'm hearing 2.0. 2.3 you tell us i'm hearing and we're gonna we're gonna talk about it for you we're gonna bring you we're gonna get you on tech week we're gonna get you i'm hearing talking uh, i'm hearing uh, at the next uh, convention here i'm hearing with with ted himself i'm hearing uh, ted's not gonna be talking his own ted talk i'm hearing it's gonna be you there and i'm seeing like people really i'm hearing really getting getting your uh your uh i'm hearing your your uh, momentum in a certain way i'm hearing of spirit but the question is i'm hearing and the focus is on where it is that that actually I'm hearing leads as I'm hearing love to a space that you hold value for Virgo and I'm almost seeing you like it's so interesting and it's it's a little freaky I'm hearing as well in a certain way where you're it's like people I'm hearing people in a certain audience they're like they're looking at you like running a race and I'm seeing you like running a race Virgo like pacing like in a circle almost and uh, people are like looking at you like cheering you on like Virgo 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 and they, they think I'm hearing they think they know you <laughs> Virgo like these people they really I'm hearing they really they they they, they are I'm hearing your your i'm hearing your honors list here with the mother of swords and the nine of swords i'm hearing they they were there i'm hearing when you were nine years old as well they uh i'm hearing they saw they saw your uh, your speech there i'm hearing as well and uh, i'm hearing uh i'm hearing that uh techie i'm hearing okay nonetheless uh again verbal i'm seeing the i'm hearing the role i'm hearing in the race that you play I'm hearing as a forefront runner. I'm hearing specifically, and also as a I'm hearing as a as a as a chosen. Uh, I'm hearing model of the act, whatever that may mean for you. Almost like it's so interesting. I'm hearing outruns the pace to run it in reverse. Okay, now whatever that may mean in particular for number, I'm seeing someone who like again people are like watching someone run a race and they think that they're gonna absolutely I'm hearing win. Like they're like you're gonna you're gonna be I'm hearing the next uh I'm hearing like I'm hearing Armaldo. Uh, uh, I'm hearing Air, I'm hearing Aramis as well. Uh, I'm hearing Air Esmeralda. I'm hearing again, um, but nonetheless, and it's like you. I'm hearing you've got it. I'm hearing your temperature's right. I'm hearing your your pace is perfect. Your uh, your talking is uh, just. Uh, I'm hearing. Uh, uh, I'm hearing placed and positioned within the grander scope of the uh, of the presentation uh, in such a way that it makes everyone think that I'm hearing you uh, are not only the prince but also the uh, the. Uh, I'm hearing the, uh, the 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 portrait that um, I'm hearing you paint of it. Very interesting. Where it's like you are all your own. Like I'm hearing this is your magic here. I'm hearing and people really Virgo. They really they really really dig you. And you've done the work. You've put in the work. You're not, I'm hearing questioning, that space perhaps for number two. I'm hearing Quintin, quintessential, I'm hearing as well. Speaker, speaker of the night. I'm hearing speaker of the house as well. I'm hearing you, you're not, um, I'm hearing, uh, I'm hearing, uh, um, I'm hearing jitters here, jitters of the Ten of Pentacles. You're not, I'm hearing wavering in the space of, uh, I'm hearing your work here in a certain way. I'm hearing what you've been working towards. I'm hearing oh, the medallion of, I'm hearing a whole lot of work uh, of. And, but again, Virgo, it's like at the end of the day, if I'm the one who's walking, I'm hearing the talk that I am hearing tell myself first that I've been testing myself on. Like, what am I doing all of this for? What am I doing all this schooling for? What am I doing, or doing, all, doing as well, all this teaching for? At the end of the day, I'm hearing, am I passing my own test here? Emotionally, the Nine of Cups in reverse. Is this a space that I feel that I am hearing can hold emotionally when I stand in it? Where I feel that I'm hearing my, uh, my, 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 my vibration I'm hearing is, uh, is, uh, I'm hearing, um, uh, I'm hearing, um, I'm hearing, whole, I'm hearing um, reflected in that space here with the high priestess and the magician. I'm hearing properly represented. Now, Virgo, 
<laughs> Again, I'm seeing someone like, like, like running in like a in like a race, and you're running so fast, Virgo. I, and I'm seeing people like watching you yet again, and they're and I'm seeing that this has to do with your work specifically. And they're like, "Oh, I'm here. Where is he gonna go? Whoa, oh, 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 we know he's gonna make it through the through the through the." The, the ribbon at, at the very end. The question is, how is he going to jump through it? And what loop is he going to, uh, I'm hearing, call his home? Very interesting. And also I'm hearing the hole here with the Three of Swords in reverse and the Eight of uh, Cups of right, whatever way that might be. For a number of you, I'm seeing that there is a focus on perhaps an actual location, perhaps for a number of you, but also a contract, also a discussion. Uh, okay. Um, but there are many decisions here for a number of you that a number of other people are involved in perhaps as well there could be the number three here the three people again you could be working with a number of individuals who kind of like all are working together in some kind of way or you're all working on the same i'm hearing mm, presentation or i'm hearing mission statement okay and again though at the end of the day i'm seeing like right as you reach the end of the rope here with the eight of cups and the mother swords of bright where it's your turn here you get up on that stage it's time to talk it's time to tell the world who you are and why it is that you hold this pen in your hand here related to the strength card nine of cups up right why it is that you feel that you i'm hearing are i'm hearing great at what you do I'm seeing you handing Virgo I'm hearing Hill here, H I L L with the fool. Okay. I'm hearing Hillel as well, related to the fool. Okay. Uh, diagonal to the devil, whatever that may mean, in particular for a number of you. So I'm hearing it's charity, related to charity. Okay, fund. Nonetheless, you hand Virgo. Your vision off. That who takes it in hand. I'm seeing for you, Virgo, that what you, I'm hearing, feel like you're working on, what others feel like you're working on, what others think that you're working on, let's say, what others expect that you're working on, people are like, oh, let's say, and I'm seeing it this way of like, you're very public, let's say, in a certain space of working in a certain, let's say, even industry, and in having a very clear sense of character there, there is then the question of the disconnect, of how how you hold that space is actually identified. I'm hearing the great Gatsby here with the mother pentacles and the daughter pentacles, not just as I'm hearing an ability here. I'm hearing to begin with the hangman reverse the fourth right. The ace of cups here mirroring the fool. I'm hearing we're messaging them here related to the hanged man. Three of pentacles of right. Daughter cups in reverse. I'm hearing someone who we haven't talked to for a long time. We're getting back in touch. I'm hearing we're playing tetherball here um, with the hanged man, the daughter of a cups, the nine of pentacles of right, and the ace of cups, seven of cups of right, mirroring this ace of cups. We, I'm hearing, are... Uh, willing i'm hearing our world forward and i'm seeing you like it's so interesting because i'm seeing like in the moment that you reach for i'm hearing the gold platter 
what you do, Virgo, in that very moment, and always take it as you will, right? A general reading as well. And I know some of you have been asking right here, I'll mention this, if I do personal readings, and I do as of yet. So if that's something of interest for you, you like a personal reading, you can access that book directly via the link in the bio description box below to Virgo, okay? If you like a one to day tune around, turn around reading um, for the full moon in Virgo to see how the energies move through for you personally, then that is available as well. A few spots there available via, again, the link as well via the bio description box below, okay? Nonetheless, Beck can mention that. Always take as you will, whatever you feel guided to watch for. Um, but yeah, Beckon, Beckon to uh, to mention that here. Nonetheless, there's a feeling here, Virgo, again, of like in the moment that you're reaching for the gold, I'm hearing again, platter. <laughs> the question is not precision. And it's not position either. Of how you hold it, or how you place it in your hand or I'm hearing around you. Virgo. It's what you merge with it. It's what you carry forward and what you've carried forward to. Leave on it, Virgo. I'm hearing Scorpio strongly. And I'm hearing verses here. Now, I'm seeing, and it's interesting because I'm seeing like, again, someone reaching a finish line and the, everyone thinks that it's like, they're, everyone's looking at their physical body, okay? It's like such an, it's kind of an abstract vision, but they're seeing their physical body moving towards the finish line. And as they're reaching to the finish line, everyone's like looking at the tips of their fingers and they're all oh, touching the end of the, end of the finish line. And what moves through, Virgo, I'm seeing is like a, uh, is a feeling. It's a release, Virgo. Now, I'm not sure what it might be alluding to. Always take it as you will. There is a focus, though, on what has been, uh, I'm hearing, fantasized about heavily here with the Nine of Cups upright and the Daughter of Wands upright. You could be dealing with a fire sign. I'm hearing a water sign as well. Someone who's like, I'm hearing equal parts water, equal parts fire. I may have a lot of uh, first house energies. Again, a lot of areas in their chart really strongly place Mars. I'm hearing Mars in the ninth house. I'm hearing fire, Sagittarius. Um, nonetheless, the, f the feeling is, yeah, if you're dealing with a fire sign, water sign, crossover, overlap, Scorpio as well, I'm hearing they are your story. I'm hearing your fairy tale uh, future. I'm hearing princess. I'm hearing I'm hearing f uh, fictional character where you're like my fantasy. I'm hearing is 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 I'm hearing really. I'm hearing a fantasy. Like if you think about a fantasy, I'm hearing that's my fantasy. <laughs> I'm hearing specifically like in whatever way that I'm for a number of you. Like you may really feel that what uh, you have a feeling space for is is so out of out of the realm of uh i'm hearing what is discussed or, or i'm hearing discussed as well to be desired by the higher font mirroring the nine of cups upright and i'm hearing again fictional character i'm hearing nancy here with the higher font and the nine of cups the ace of wands in reverse and i'm seeing that that you might be dealing uh, they're 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 the um, there's been a lot, I'm hearing a lot of back and forth here. I'm hearing about legal matters here, perhaps as it pertains to, I'm hearing, what What do you love? What do I love? What do we love? What do you love? What do I love? What do we love? What is the space that we're not even, I'm hearing really, we're really, I'm hearing here uh, to uh, to define, I'm hearing as love or as, a, I'm hearing a letter that we write qualifying it or quantifying it. Um <laughs> It's interesting, Virgo, because I'm seeing that at the end of the day, there is, again, a release of the room. I'm hearing of the remote control here with the Son of Pentacles in reverse and the Devil in reverse. I'm seeing, I'm hearing you, I'm hearing you let love in. I'm hearing specifically Virgo. I'm hearing you let love in. You listen, I'm hearing, to your higher self, your higher guidance to lead the, I'm hearing, the way home this time and what has been a matter of troubleshooting like practicing and solve problem solving and i'm hearing do i do i uh, do i do i do i do i <laughs> i'm hearing do i yes do i no do i i'm hearing hi do i buy do i hold do i let go and what is it at the end of the day that um we can hold on to of let's say the space of uh i'm hearing 
clarity of, 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 of that uh, conversation. Very interesting where it's like, at the end of the day, I remember like two people kind of like masquerading around a certain movie scene that they both know they got a play in here with the six of cups upright, coming through through the moon. Okay, the three of wands and the death card. You may absolutely be dealing with Scorpio. You may, I'm gonna read this is your own energy. I'm getting strongly, you may have a lot of Scorpio in your chart. It could be your moon sign. Here comes the death card again, right over the daughter of swords upright. I mean, we have a lot that we wanna say. But yet again, I'm hearing, do we speak about it? Or do we just, I'm hearing, say it with the stage. Very interesting here. Uh, and I'm seeing again that it has to do with matters of uh, how you physically present something, how you, if you feel, how you perceive yourself as well, to be physically involved in a certain space. I'm hearing also by way of your performance. Okay, so. Virgo, Virgo, so very exciting. Now, the Moon Station Cycle readings are now out and available, and that is the extended Moon Cycle reading for the Moon moon in uh, Virgo, full Moon in Virgo. So if you'd like to see how these energies move through to the tail end of the Moon Cycle, leading up into, again, the new Moon, making a full circle, uh, to the new Moon in Pisces, right on the 9th of March, then you can access those readings and uh, the, accompany, uh, the accompanied uh, calendars, specifically uh, targeted for each of the signs, depending on which sign you order, uh, via the link in the bio description box below and that helps to take on a hands-on approach from matters manifestation so if that's something of focus for you if you would like to uh see how let's say the energies are moving through for your particular sign during this particular cycle of the moon's phase and uh to see kind of also perhaps which uh, particular areas of life might be highlighted at each stage of the moon cycle then feel free to join this session um via the link again in the bio description box below. Nonetheless, thank you so much again for tuning in, Virgo. Thank you all so much again for your dear support. Love and light to you here. Have a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful February and full moon in your very own sign. Love and light to you. Thank you all so much for connecting and for all of your likes, your comments, your shares, your subscriptions. I'm so touched by all of you. Thank you so much for connecting and tuning into you. And for those who've been following for quite some time now, thank you so much for connecting. And uh, I feel all of the support, love, and light to you. Thank you again for tuning in. And I'll see you soon. Bye, Virgo.